So I just wanted to remind you, you know, of the immense um, health benefits of the mixture, um, raw cheese and unheated honey, you know. I've been eating that now for uh, since 2018. And that is truly, truly an, an incredible mixture. And, you know, the funny thing is like, because I'm here on the Tenerife Island and the native, it seems like the native people of this island, uh, you know, they, they, they had known that because, you know, when you go to eat somewhere out in a restaurant and they bring you a traditional uh, dish, you know, you always get um, raw cheese, raw goat cheese here. It's mainly goat cheese, but always, you know, uh, honey, <laughs> they use honey as a sauce. So raw. So that's how it looks like. You know, this is uh, raw and soft uh, goat's cheese. Goat's cheese meaning uh, cheese made of uh, goat's milk. And that has to be raw. Mi raw means uh, it hadn't been pasteurized. Pasteurization, in case you don't know, is a process where you heat up uh, the milk, you know, to a very high temperature, uh, you know, so that it can um, uh, be preserved for a much longer time. And also, of course, you know, to keep it germ-free. And so, you know, it's all about the shelf life and making and keeping it safe because you know probably a lot of people would get sick you know if they ate if they drank it raw you know we should also not forget that because uh you know the cows and the animals from the industry aren't necessarily the healthiest one ones so yeah honey you know mixed with uh raw cheese but it can be any cheese it can also be sheep cheese or in this case, goat cheese, depending on the location where you are, you know. In warmer climates, um, people tend to have uh, much more goats, you know. Uh, cows, you think more like in uh, northern climates, like in, uh, you know, north in Europe, uh, America. Now, you know, why the combination uh, cheese, you know, raw cheese and honey? You know, why the combination cheese and honey, you might wonder. And uh, this, you know, as I said, this is also what we see, you know, um, among all the old traditional uh, cultures, you know, when you ask for cheese, they bring you cheese together with raw honey, as I told you. But why, you know, now it's so funny, but uh, nutritional scientists, um, they discovered, you know, that this is actually an excellent mixture. It makes you uh, get and absorb much more minerals you know not sorry not absorb you know because these are not plants you know we are not vegans luckily um you know we do not have to worry about the word absorption because you know everything that we eat is bioavailable this is a good thing about the natural human diet there is nothing indigestible in it there is no fibers you know nothing that we can there is no cellulose there are no anti-nutrients, you know, no toxins that you find in seeds, in plants. And, you know, we do not lack 15 nutrients that ve vegans cannot get. So this just aside, you know, but, um, you know, why the mixture? Why? So, as I said, you know, it, it, it came out that um, the honey, you know, when eaten simultaneously with uh, cheese, but it has to be, of course, unheated uh, as I you know, I don't. I hope I do not have to mention it every single time that raw, 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 unheated, unheated. It's I'm all about natural human diet, so everything is raw and unheated, and unpasteurized and unsalted. Okay, so we got that out of the way. So um, it it came out that uh, you know uh, this uh, changes the it kind of makes it kind of turns the cheese more into a min mineral bomb, you know, compared to when eating alone, you know, when you eat cheese alone, it's uh, acts in a different way, you know, it's like, um, uh, it's, it's more like a sponge, you know, it acts more like a sponge, but, uh, you know, when eaten together and simultaneously with honey, you know, then you get a mineral bomb. And now, you know, you might ask yourself, oh, but, then maybe that's just a fairy tale, you know, how can we verify that? Well, as you know, I'm all about, you know, doing the only verified, you know, scientifically proven things, you know, I'm, I'm like the opposite of blind beliefs. So 
You know, this, you know, when you start eating, let's say from today, right? You mark it in your calendar and, you know, just keep eating that just sometimes, you know, it would be ideal if you can have every day, like, you know, one bite, let's say you take a piece of that, this size, okay? Every day with honey, you can have it in the morning, you can have it as a snack in between because it even tastes good. Now, you know, you will see, you know, what changes will occur in you, within you, on you, okay? And, uh, you know, then you can, uh, you can tell that uh, this is a vitamin bomb, you know, 